Breast cancer is the most commonly occurring cancer in women worldwide, with around 2 million new cases diagnosed every year. The majority of these cases occur in high-income countries, but in recent decades we've seen a steadily increase in the incidence of breast cancer in low to middle income countries. The causes for these trends are not known, but are likely to reflect societal changes, for example, um, the adoption of more westernised lifestyle and, and diets, um, urbanisation, more sedentary behaviour, as well as women who are having fewer children and having their first child at a later age. And we know that all these different factors can influence breast cancer risk. Despite the lower incidence of breast cancer in low to middle income countries, the women who develop breast cancer in these regions tend to have much poorer survival. We don't fully understand the causes of this. It's likely to reflect access to healthcare in some countries, but there could be other factors which could also influence survival in, in these regions. Much of the research which has been conducted to date has been focused on women in high-income countries and there's been a lack of research on the causes of breast cancer in low to middle-income countries. So here at IARC we are working with local partners to develop more research on the causes of breast cancer and on breast cancer survival in various low to middle-income country settings. So for example with my colleague Dr Sabina Rinaldi we are working with colleagues in South Africa and in Morocco to develop case control studies on, on breast cancer. And within these studies, we are collecting detailed epidemiologic data, clinical data, as well as blood and tumour tissue, um, with the hope of identifying new causes of breast cancer. The ABCDO study, led by my colleague, Dr. Valerie McCormack, is a cohort of more than 2,000 breast cancer patients recruited in sub-Saharan Africa, which has collected detailed epidemiologic and clinical data, as well as tumour samples, with the aim of identifying factors which influence survival and survivalship among breast cancer patients in Africa. Breast cancer in younger women is also a growing problem in many low to middle income countries, and we don't really have a good understanding of why breast cancer is becoming more common among premenopausal women. One of the studies we're conducting is the PreCAMA study, which is being conducted across five Latin American countries, which has recruited 1,500 breast cancer patients and 1,500 controls with the aim of identifying causes of premenopausal breast cancer in this region um, and then following up the patients for, for survival.